let's start with the Schumann resonance. So you can think of the Schumann resonance sort of the heartbeat of the Earth in a sense, uh, meaning the Earth has an ionosphere, which is a very complex interaction between the Earth's neutral atmosphere and the Sun's fully ionized, very charged So it's kind of this calm atmosphere on the Earth and this very chaotic, violent um, energy is being blasted out of the sun. And so the ionosphere is kind of this bubble of plasma, like a big soap bubble around the planet. This bubble of plasma reflects, has sort of mirror like on the bottom and it reflects frequencies. So basically creates this spherical cavity And guess what? The actual frequencies of the spherical cavity, just like a tuning fork has a resonant frequency based on its geometry, so does spherical uh, resonators or cavities have resonant frequencies. And the resonant frequency is 7.83 hertz, which is the Earth's fundamental note. This frequency is created, again, from the complex interaction of the Earth's ionosphere with the sun it becomes very energetic and we have somewhere around 7 million lightning strikes every day around planet Earth from all this energy. And so this tremendous voltage potential between the ionosphere and the surface of the Earth creates all these lightning strikes and all those lightning strikes ring this spherical resonator to the tune of 7.83 hertz. And it does have higher harmonic frequencies. I wanted to just show you this chart here done by the Global Coherence Initiative. This is where some, some of my new information is coming from. It's kind of connected to heart math. I really love their information because they have over 200 published studies and they have now, I think, eight sensitive magnetometers around planet Earth and measure the Schumann resonance on a daily basis. And contrary to what the New Age people are saying, the Schumann resonance is not going up. It's still the same 7.8 and then it's got all the higher harmonics and the, main, the reason I'm expanding my window to 0 to 50 hertz is because there's one higher harmonic at 45 hertz that's not as strong, but it's still significant. And then the harmonics really drop off after that. So the Schumann resonances are really between this 0 to 30 hertz range. And you can even see from this graph here, there's a couple little spikes below 5 hertz even. Or I mean, so it's still kind of there, but it mainly starts at 7.83 and then goes on up. And again, like I said, this frequency range is the frequencies of the brain, what the cells respond to, what the tissues are ideally healed, and even the frequencies we emit. 